Half of ovarian cancer does not come from your ovaries. Mind blown. Hi, I'm your local OBGYN. I love women and let's talk about it. So for a very, very long time, you would assume that if you heard that you had ovarian cancer, ovarian cancer risk, or anything about ovarian cancer, of course it would come from the ovaries, which are these little white, round, rubbery organs that sit at the end of your fallopian tubes. So your uterus is like an upside down pear, and then coming out the top kind of like ears are these like stringy tubes, which we call the fallopian tubes, and then at the end of the fallopian tubes, you have these cute little white rubbery nuggets. Those are your ovaries. Now, the reason ovarian cancer is super scary is because the fallopian tubes and the ovaries kind of like float around inside of your abdomen. So they touch lots of things, your bladder, your bowel, your abdominal wall, and they're sloshing around in a little bit of fluid that's there. So if an abnormal cell shows up there, the risk of it traveling to any of these other places is pretty darn high. But the evidence has mounted over time that half of ovarian cancer comes from the surface of the ovary but the other half doesn't. So we have stronger and stronger evidence that half of ovarian cancer is actually coming from your fallopian tubes, which is why we talk about fallopian tubes coming out during lots of procedures as a risk reduction surgery. So when you think of ovarian cancer, we have to kind of put together the ovary and the fallopian tube because they both kind of share relatively equal risks overall.